We love food. Well, as Malaysians, it's kindly never that we take our food seriously. Expensive lah. What? Subsidies for egg and chicken just ended. Prices for various meat products are at an all-time high. Why leh? Heat wave, grass die, animal die, heat stroke, low immune system, new disease, more prompt to disease attack. Huh? How leh? Well, you see that Lego set there? What if? Just as Lego, we solved the problem from the building blocks on the molecular scale, diving deep into the very code that make up all organisms and changing them for the better. Oh, che, gene editing, ma. Technique like CRISPR Cas9 can be used in ensuring food security. Don't know how this works? Let us look at it from four branches of science. Now, let's talk about the role of biology in gene editing. CRISPR technique is applied in gene editing. CRISPR is a protein enzyme that is essentially a pair of molecular scissors with incredible ability to hone in on specific sequence of DNA through RNA guide. It then cuts off a segment of the double helix. Next, scientists utilize the cells from DNA repair machinery to add or delete pieces of genetic material or to make changes to the DNA by replacing an existing segment with a customized DNA sequence. CRISPR-Cas9 has been widely used in various animals, such as inserting an alligator gene into genomes of catfish to protect them from disease. Beef cattle, which are exposed to high temperatures, can lead to heat strokes or even death. This is where CRISPR comes in. The technique has been used to increase the heat tolerance of cattle, especially important with a recent rise in heat weight. Chemistry is essential in gene editing because it helps in modifying the Cas9 protein and other molecules to make them more stable and effective. There are a few ways. Firstly, by replacing amino acids. Proteins are made out of tiny building blocks called amino acids just like how Lego structures are made of individual Lego buildings. One way scientists can improve Cas9's ability is by replacing certain amino acids with others that are more stable. It's like flipping some Lego bricks for stronger ones. Besides, scientists also use buffer solutions. Buffer solution is a special mixture of chemicals that help keep the acidity and attraction between molecules of Cas9 protein stable. Buffer solutions ensure Cas9 remain in its best shape, providing them with a powerful tool for gene editing in animals. Physics is instrumental in the operation of microscopes used to observe cellular processes, including gene editing. For example, principles of optics allow researchers to visualize cells and DNA strains. Advanced microscopy techniques like electron microscope are used to visualize the very minute detail at the molecular level. As such, these tools are very much needed in scientists' quest in improving the techniques of gene editing and achieving their desired outcomes. Gene sequence alignment is also crucial in gene editing. It's like finding the right key to unlock a specific door. If they are misaligned, nothing will happen. This is where mathematics comes into play. Three steps. One, identify the location of the door. Scientists have developed algorithms that can find the location of the target gene within the genome by comparing the sequence of interest with existing database reference, thus simulating and finding our door in an endless line of doors. 2. The journey to the door and the key to unlock it. Guide RNA or gRNA is designed by employing algorithms that can find the optimal binding sites within the target DNA sequence, thus finding the right key to unlock the door. 3. Less mistakes. Genes look similar, thus by analyzing the similarity between the target gene and potential mistakes, the most optimal key can be selected. In conclusion, this for branches of science enable scientists to create precise and effective tools like CRISPR-Cas9 for modifying genes in animals. By understanding and utilizing these tools, gene editing has a high potential to improve animal health. Lastly, it can cure genetic diseases and unlock more mysteries of genetics to improve livestock production. Imagine a future world in which you could grow super strains of tomatoes that maintain ripeness long after being picked, and livestock that will not die easily to disease. In the near future, it is all possible. It may sound scary and can bring with it worrying implication. But like every revolutionary technology in history, we will push through as long as we always remember our original goal and stay on track to achieve it. Uh. Then, we'll be less worried about four-legged chickens and more worried about how to finish this nasi lemak. <laughs>